Hello and welcome to this presentation of Excel to Sage. My name is Aura Martirosian and I'm going to show you how to import your Shopify orders into Sage. So what's Excel to Sage? Well it's the final piece of the Sage puzzle. It allows you to import anything that you need from an integration perspective into Sage. It links with various different databases like MySQL and SQL Server as well as e-commerce solutions from Amazon, eBay, Shopify, uh, various different web shops as well as other billing systems. It can bring data in from normal file formats like CSVs and XML and Excel spreadsheets and uh, there are also modules for connecting to EDI networks like uh, um, Tesco's, Morrison's and so on. What can I use it for? Well you can use it for all major day-to-day -day transactions including static information like customers and suppliers as well as day-to-day -day transactions like sales orders and purchase orders. It has a very informative log file which will easily help you highlight uh, areas in your data which may be incorrect so that you can correct them and rerun the import. So let's have a look at the Shopify order in particular. So Shopify provide various different uh, columns on their export and uh, uh, some of these columns may require lookups. So for example the line item SKU might not match the product codes in Sage. So what our import allows us to do is to set up very simple Excel spreadsheets which can do the lookup on the fly on the way in. So let's go and have a look at this in action. So here's my Sage system and I haven't got anything in here at the moment. And what I'll do is I'll just go and have a look at the file that I've downloaded from Shopify. And that's what that looks like, just a CSV file. So what I need to do is just literally press one button, the Shopify button, and what happens is it uh, starts the import of the Shopify orders and this little black box comes up to say that it started the process. It's going to look at the CSV file. It's doing the lookups on the fly. And uh, when it's finished importing all the orders from uh, the CSV into Sage, a notepad file will open up showing us all the orders that have been imported. We can then just check that to make sure that it's OK and uh, uh, see the number of orders that have been imported and then close the notepad file to complete the import process and then we can then just check it in Sage to see uh, it's as expected. And here's the log file. So let's have a quick look. Yeah, it's gone through and it's found the data and it's imported 10 sales orders into Sage. So I'll now just close that. Uh, just check it and here we are here are the Excel to say Shopify imports and then if I look at the one that's uh, by Peter Fleming he's um, ordered some books uh, that's his reference on Shopify if I open that up I can see he paid 79 pounds for that and I've got some descriptions in here and these are all going to a single Shopify account in Sage but each one of these will have its own uh, delivery address and so on. And on the order header, I can um, match various different things that have been provided to me. So I know that's been paid. That might be his email and so on. Dead easy. So you just download the file, press one button. So what are the benefits? Well, there are lots of benefits. The most important one being it's very easy to set up and use. It typically takes less than 15 minutes to set up and you get free 30 day trial. It's sold on an annual license plan for which you'll get all of the new features that may be added during the uh, period and also free software upgrades so you can then utilize it with the next version of Sage. You get full email and remote access support from our support team. And as a valued client, you get discounts on our other products, things like mobile to Sage, which allow you to front end Sage with an iPhone, an iPad or a browser for taking orders and so on. EDI to Sage, which allow you to link Sage to the major retailers like Tesco's and Asda's and so on. We have Sage Report Scheduler, which allows you to run Sage reports uh, out of office hours and have it emailed to you. So that saves you precious time. And we have Doc Hyperlink Credit Controller, which allows you to email out statements and for your clients to click on a hyperlink to download copy invoices, thus improving your uh, debt collection processes. And lots and lots of other solutions, which you can uh, find details of either on our website or on our YouTube channel. Thank you very much for your time and interest in our Shopify order import into Sage using Excel to Sage. Please feel free to contact me if you've got any questions and or to discuss your requirements to uh, set up a free trial. Thank you.